A woman miraculously survived being shot in the head by her husband, clinging to life in their basement for six days before she was rescued. Sherry Langer was found in the basement of her home in Omaha, Nebraska, on Wednesday by a police officer who was called to check on her by a concerned friend. She was still hiding after being shot in the head by her husband, Carl, six days earlier on December the 7th in a domestic dispute. After shooting his wife, Carl killed himself in the garage. Sherry Langel, 67, survived being shot in the head by her husband Carl, 68, and spent six days hiding in the basement of their home before she was found by police. After shooting his wife in the head, Carl killed himself in their garage. Sherry did not know he was dead when she was found on Wednesday, six days after being shot. Afraid her husband might be upstairs, Sherry stayed in the basement for six days. Unbeknownst to his wife Carl committed suicide by carbon monoxide poisoning in the garage. He died of carbon monoxide poisoning, leading investigators to believe he gassed himself. Investigators were surprised that Sherry was overcome by the carbon monoxide in the home. Sherry was unaware that he was dead when she was found. She told police she decided to stay in the basement because she was afraid he would attack her again if she went upstairs. She also had a broken ankle but does not remember how it was injured. The woman did not have a phone to call 911 with but she had food and water which sustained her. The extent of her injuries are not clear but she was able to speak to police when she was found and she has since been interviewed in hospital. Carl, 68, used a 22 pistol to shoot her according to police. The couple had been married for decades, have children and grandchildren. One police officer who has spoken to her since she was taken to hospital marveled at her survival. Considering she got shot in the head. I think she's in pretty decent shape, Sarpy County Chief Deputy Sheriff Greg London told Omaha.com. Police paid a welfare check to the Nebraska home. Police then heard Sherry screams. The grandmother is in hospital recovering. Police said she was in pretty decent shape considering her injuries.